Mr. Speaker, a couple of months ago, I was talking to one of my friends. So I texted them and said, hey, how are you doing? And she responded with, oh, not great. I just got catcalled by a guy. And so I responded back with, oh, are you okay? Is there anything I can do? Have you told your parents? And what she said absolutely broke my heart and awakened me to this prevalent issue in New Zealand society. She responded with, I'm used to it. Mr. Speaker, women in New Zealand, because this is an issue that predominantly faces women specifically, women should not be used to it. They should not have to be used to it. And whilst I have been given just two minutes to um, explain how I would change the mindset of an entire um, society of men, I will give it my best crack. Um, so what I would do is there's currently a lot of charities who are sadly not given that much funding from the government who teach women and girls self-defense. This should not be a female issue. They should not be responsible for the actions and mindsets of some men who think it is acceptable to judge and comment on unsolicited on the appearance of others. Now, what I would do is have an intermediates in high schools and an intermediate so we can set, change this mindset from a young age. They come from a household where this, sadly, this kind of behavior might be okay, is teach men about boundaries and, and about consent and both of those and how you need to have clear boundaries with women. You need to respect those boundaries and consent, how it is not an optional thing. It is a mandatory thing. And, and things such as a, some, a female who is drunk cannot legally consent. So those sort of things. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.